Welcome, everyone, to the Real Whovians Cast, episode 808. I am your host, Matrix Lord 212, and I am with Scott. What's up, Scott? Greetings and welcome to Doctor Who. What's up, Ray? Welcome, my children. What's up, Chris? <laughs> What's a Doctor Who? Yeah. So, <laughs> I do want to go to Doctor What. Yeah. <laughs> Doctor do Al. Yes. I do want to wish Jenna Louise Coleman a happy birthday. She is 30 years old today. Ooh. So, happy She's birthday. 30. Happy birthday to Jenna Louise Coleman. Also, hey, hey. also, happy birthday to the man, the myth, the legend, Russell T. Davis. He is 53. So, happy birthday to you, sir. Which, that's awesome stuff. All right. That's it. Take care right now. <laughs> Thank you. Bro. Right. Thank you right. Right. <laughs> so uh, there is getting, there's a lot of people that are really, uh, I guess it's a mixed bag of emotions for the new companion. I mean, I like her. And I think yeah. we I see nothing wrong. I don't, yeah. But there are other people that are getting a little vicious, I think. Um, why don't we just give her a chance? How about that? Can we give her a yeah. chance? I mean, like I said, like I said, I'm on the fence because I know how mock it's been, but I'm going to give her a chance. Listen, we're not all going to get our way, you know. I mean, no. I've been dying to have like Madame Vastra as the damn companion, just or Kavarian. and 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 right. Well, I mean, a younger version of Kavarian. It could be weird universe time travel split, but I, I, you know, we all can't get our way. I mean, but let's just we have to deal with the, the we have to. I guess make the most of it, yeah. right? I think she, you know, she's probably going to be tough like Donna. Yeah, be like Ace, cocky like Ace, yeah. like, like Martha. She already sounds like she's going to be an Ace, Ace esque anyway. Probably so kind of like Martha a little bit. Which Ace, Ace and Tua? <laughs> uh, what What do you think, uh, Chris? Worst companion ever. No, no, I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. No, well, we, we, I don't know how anyone can make a judgment yet. Right. Like, we, yeah, they just judged on the promo. Yeah, I thought the promo was a little meh, but, you know, I'm not going to say, oh, it's a disaster. She's going to be the one. No. I, I See, he, he, this is the thing. They, they have been having these shorts lately that alluding to the fact that the promo wasn't necessarily a promo. It was quite possibly an episode, mm-hmm. okay. Which I had said from the beginning that I don't think they're going to cheat the fans and just do a promo. It has to be an episode. Now, it's I find it interesting that there is a possibility that they were filming today. Uh, this was coming out. I don't have any more information about that. I lost my damn article. I do apologize. I will come back tomorrow and follow up on it, but. Uh, it would, wouldn't be a shock to me that if they're going to film in May, they actually film like a couple days before May. I mean, really. I mean, get a little bit of a jump start if she can. If you're not doing the play and just, you know, maybe that. Get some good weather, so. Right. Get some, at least get the outside shots and yeah. uh, base shots for – Three, four episodes. Well, at least get an episode in the can, at least. Yeah. Now, maybe they're not filming the Christmas special first. They don't really have to film the Christmas special now because it's nowhere near Christmas, so they could probably finish the Christmas special in the seventh episode or the eighth episode. So basically, they really don't have to do a Christmas special now, I don't think. So, I mean, on that note, she could possibly appear. She could possibly not. We'll have to find out. But regardless, again, they probably don't have to do the Christmas special first. What do you think, Chris? Yeah, I mean, like I said, I don't think she's going to be in the Christmas special. But, um, you know, honestly, I really don't have an opinion about her until I see a couple episodes with her. Um, You know, hey, uh, like I said, I just hope that she's, she's just a normal person. I hope she's not some sort of cosmic universal force. Yeah. You know? I hope she's not some sort of like, you know, one in a million chance being that things happen to. I just hope that she's just somebody that he likes 
and you know he thinks hey it'd be fun to travel with them and they just go traveling and for the love of all that is doctor who get off of the planet earth yes yes yeah Please. I mean, that's getting annoying. It, 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 it was annoying the first season, and it seriously has gotten old. Another it's, thing. It's dragging the series down. Yeah. That's it's true. like a repetitive joke, which gets boring at parties when you hear it all the time. I can, uh, Grant, I know they can only do, they're only doing like 13 episodes, but from here on out, the next several seasons. Well, actually, yeah, no. There are three episodes on Earth, the rest of them in space. I don't care if it's in the future get them off of Earth. <clears throat> Actually, correction. They're doing 15 episodes. Okay. They're doing, still, I'll, expl I'll explain. Well, let me explain. Let me explain. Let me explain. They're doing the Christmas special this year. That's not counted as Series 10. We are also getting the episodes back that were taken away. Not made up. I mean, in other words, it's going to be like a Russell T. Davis type of season. Okay. 13 plus a Christmas special. So it's technically 15 episodes of Doctor Who they're going to film. And keep in mind, too, that because Moffat's leaving, don't think they're going to film the second Christmas special as the last episode. Mm. So he could probably want to do the both Christmas specials back to back. But again, maybe Ooh. he might not want to do that. I don't know if Peter Capaldi's going to stay. Ooh, here's a notion. Have both Christmas episodes uh, linked in some manner, so that way, if he's going to do it that way, yeah. well, you can't because you can have the Christmas special, then a whole freaking season. Well, that's the, true. That's true. But no. the thing is, too, I don't think they will film now that I'm thinking about it because he has to have time to make the decision to stay or not stay. And if they film that, that means they're going to have to do the regeneration thing right away. And I don't. So, in other words, they're probably going to do really film the secondary Christmas special last, which makes sense. Which won't be filmed right before Christmas. It will probably be filmed. Mm. I don't know, whatever. And I, and I and I also pray to God that the companion leaves out her owner called like Martha, because I'm I'm not even rude. I've seen her die all the time or whatever. Or something happened to her. You're just like getting so old now and repetitive. It's like, really, is that all you can do with a companion? She should be able to go out her own accord and. Whatever. Yeah, it doesn't have to be a big thing for that, too. Yeah. Also, keep in mind, it's a 10-month shoot. So, May to probably, what, March? Yeah. It's mm. so basically filming the Christmas special in in um, February, March, possibly, for the following year, you know? I mean, fe February of 2017 for the Christmas 2017. Yeah, whatever. All right, so again, and if Moffat says he has his way, we'll have more than that. So who knows what he has up his sleeve. Uh, I do hope Moffat can get more episodes because it would be nice to have a bigger season. It would be nice to have like a, a Walking Dead length season of 60 yeah. episodes or more, but I doubt that. So any thoughts, Chris? No. I'm just happy we're going to be getting some episodes, but I'm not happy that we're not getting any this year except for the Christmas special. And Classy, which you can count. I know it's a spin-off, but that's technically in the cleaning in it. All right, so we are getting Sea Devils. Yes. I heard Capaldi wants Autons. Um, the Daleks we're getting. Uh, rumor. See no more, too. Oh, well, no, well, no, actually. Here's <laughs> Here's the thing. If we're going to get one Gatiss, can we pray for the Ice Warriors? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. The ice war I, want, I want Ice Warriors or Draconians. All right. Could we have an Ice war? Could we have, like, two villains go against each other? Like, Ooh, the yeah. Ice Warriors versus Gatiss in the eye. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. Ice Warriors wake up and they got Gatiss in the eye. <laughs> what, if they have, what if they have a war? With with a lot of the Doctor's villains, except the Daleks and Cybermen, or everybody go to war with the Daleks. Like bring back the villains. Like everybody go to war with the Daleks. Like something yeah. happens, and it's like the reverse of the Alliance, where the Santarans, the Salorians, all these people go into war with that with Davros and the Daleks. That would be cool. Like just when they think they're conquering. 
you know, they keep getting annihilated because everybody's teaming up to go after them. We see the Thals and the Movellans return. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Maybe the Autons are a little more powerful than we think. Or Planet of the Maybe. You know, Nestine Consciousness. Yes. Maybe the return of the nano genes that they used from the Doctor Dances, the Empty Child, and they kind of twisted it into Solomon and Daleks, but maybe use that to bring Rack River song by you restoring her body and then uploading her back into her consciousness. That would be cool. <clears throat> Missy is probably going to, if all that's the thing, if Capaldi's going, she's going. Yeah. So maybe she. But we need a, if we're going to get a new doctor, we're going to need a new master. And, so and we'll probably so, master. So we'll see them fairly doing anything for her, hopefully. I'm going to say, I know it's been said a lot in the past. I'm going to say Charles Dance this time. Unless, of course, the doctor. I mean, but then again, I don't know. If Peter Capaldi stays and then it's going to be missing, then if it's going to be a younger doctor, it might be a younger master. I don't know. So. To me, if they're going to make, it, make them young again, have the master be maybe two to three years older than him. Because that's how I always looked at it. Yes, they went to school together and all, but. You know what they could do? He, he could, the master's regeneration could be unstable because he turned into a woman. So yeah. he could become like a 15 this cycle year old screwed kid. Him up. He could become like a 15 year old kid, master, or a 16 year old kid, like a. Like oh, like a Damian Wayne type of setup. <laughs> they turn him into a 16 year old kid or something yeah who knows and then and then the doctor makes like people like arrest the kid or like we'll put him in the juvie or something <laughs> yeah. he's like oh, okay. or, or you should um, or you should take the kid to the candy man and then yeah um wait, what did you say Ray? you got a little freaky with Bring the, him into the candy man <laughs> I don't know what you said with the candy man. All right. Um, all right, guys, is that it? That's it. No sleep no more. I don't want to watch that sequel, please. It was horrible. <laughs> oh, I got Gators in the eyes. I got Gators in the eyes. Oh. No, please, don't do that. Please. I had a string of Gators. I don't, I don't mind seeing the actor back who was in it, no, but I don't no, want to no, 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 no. Just, just do, 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 do. erase your mind from that. Yeah. No sleep no more. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, take care. Bye for now.